first, I must say thank you to Vision Glow. Uh, they kind of reached out to me and asked if I would be willing to have the Oakland Police Department participate uh, in this project. Uh, because I believe uh, that is more uh, than enforcement. Uh, you have to do prevention, you have to do intervention, but you also have to connect with community. And this Vision Quote project was an opportunity for the Oakland Police Department to connect with community. So Kathy, thank you for uh, for making that invitation to us. And, and thank my staff, uh, who as soon as we sent out an email last to our staff and said who would like to participate in this project, uh, we have staff emailing back immediately saying we would love to be a part of it. And that, that is the culture of the police department that I'm trying uh, to change, to make Oakland a more a community uh, focused police department, one in which appreciates having a relationship with community and understanding how projects like this can help us build trust. So I thank my staff, I thank Kathy, but also I have to acknowledge that this is a moment uh, of crisis in this city, that there are 64 homicides. Yesterday we had three homicides in one day. We are dealing with some serious issues in our city right now. I think this is not a time to fight uh, one division versus another, uh, one uh, political opinion versus another. This is about public safety. This is about people's lives. Uh, when I took this job, I didn't take this job because I wanted to be a part of politics. I took this job because I wanted to be a part of public safety yes. to save lives. <laughs> so I say projects like this uh, is a community's commitment to saying that we all want to live in a community that is peaceful, where people can feel safe, where our seniors that live right across the street can feel comfortable walking in our community to Walgreens to simply go and get medication. They email me all the time saying, Chief, it's not safe to walk across the street. We all have to do better, and it doesn't take law enforcement to do it. It takes all of us coming together collectively and saying, we want to see different. We want to see something different. We want our community to be safe. Please bear with me. 